If you want a walk like that, or you want a walk like this, just keep watching the video. Oh, hello guys! So, in this short video, I want to show you how you can make your KD Plasma desktop look like Windows 11. I know some of you might like the week how Windows 11 looks. So, this video might be for you. So, without further ado, let's go to the video. Okay, guys, so I have a fresh install of KDE Neon right here and we gonna start customizing it. It's gonna take, well, no time at all. <laughs> we'll see, of course, we'll see. So, let's go to the appearance first. Go to the settings, go to the appearance and go to the get new global teams. Now there should be already some mimicking the Windows 11, but we're gonna look for something. Let's say Windows. I know one that it's pretty good. 11. Yeah, that one. This is the Windows 11 dark team. Let's install that. Shouldn't take much. You have the white one too if you like that. Let's install that one too, just in case. You know me, I like the dark team, but you might like the white. So, it's always good idea to change it and have both installed. Alright, the dark one is already installed. Let's wait for the white. Alright. And the white it's already installed now. Well, basically what you should do, just click on the one you like. In my case, this is the dark team. And it gives you the option by default, just change the appearance settings. I would try to check the desktop and windows layout and just click apply. Let's see what's gonna happen. All right, it's already coming. Oh, yeah. All right. So you already have a pretty close, if not the Windows 11 look already. And the menu it's here. You have all the apps, you have the search button and you have the Windows, the dark Windows 11 wallpaper. Now that was pretty easy, isn't it? Let's check out what's gonna happen with the dark team. We're gonna do the same, check the desktop and Windows layout. Just click apply, wait for the, <laughs> the setup to finish. All right, you have the white team installed too. I think this is the default in Windows 11, isn't it? Anyway, so this is the short way you can do this. If you like, I'm gonna show you the long way or the manual way as I call it. Let's check it out. Okay guys, so I reset the appearance of Windows 11 and now I'm gonna try to do it manually and replicate what you just saw. So let's begin. Just right click on the bar and click the edit main. Uh, <laughs> what was it? Enter edit mode. Yeah, that's right. Okay, so now I would just add another spacer here. I need another one actually. So here in the middle we can put the menu bar 
and the applications. Now we are pretty close to what we like, isn't it? Let's check it out. Yep, it's already pretty close. So now we need to find this menu that is the same as Windows 11. We're gonna do that by... Let's go to the app widgets. Now here get go to the get new widgets. Download new plasma widgets. Now look for the menu and there should be one already that's called yeah menu 11. Just install that one. Alright. Now go back to the edit mode. Add widgets. This time just look for the menu. Double click and well <laughs> I overdo it as you can see but that's not a problem. Just let's clean a few of those. We don't need that one anymore so we're gonna just come on gonna just drag that one here and this should be pretty much what we wanted. Alright, this is pretty close. Now let's go back to the appearance. Now you can just select as we did before but don't click the desktop and window layout, just click apply. And it's pretty close. Now the icons, if you go to the icon tab, you have a Windows 11 icon team that you can find from here. Just search for Windows one more time. Well, if I can <laughs> type correctly, of course. Now here's the one we need. There might be a couple more like this one for example, if you want to try that one, you can go for it. But yeah, this is it. This is what you need. Now, the only thing that's left is the wallpaper. And there is one right here that comes with the team. You can just click on it, click apply and you have a pretty close to the Windows 11 look. I know it's pretty simple for most of you but some of the new users that switching to Linux and you want to well play with Linux and sound and look familiar with the Windows 11 that they used before that's how you do it so I hope you like the video and I'll see you in the next one bye